What's up, Aries? This will be your December 2020 general reading. Okay. Loving up to roll. Okay. Huh. Oh. Uh. Well, for the Aries I'm reading for in the past. Coming into December, high of you. Spirits comes in talking about with the five of cups. You're looking back in the past at the three cups spilt over. And three cups spilt over. <clears throat> got some red stuff falling out of it. But you're not noticing that you got two full cups, Aries in the past that you wasn't paying attention to all right your five of cups was clarified by major arcana number seven the chariot cancer coming through well anyway you took action or maybe you took action on this on this nostalgia that you had looking back on past relationships and ideologies maybe that you had about relationships and how relationships should go and somehow honey it made you get kind of closed off you know you got in your head maybe and start pulling back somehow maybe financially you know, tangibly, you know. You're no better than me, Aries. But in your own present position, you got six of swords. So you want, you know, hop on, you know, whatever. And move on forward with what you were thinking about, how you thought about this relationship. Why I keep saying it's a relationship is because spirit of marriage, not just a relationship, it could be a marriage. Uh, you may be going through a, a breakup or a divorce or something because you got the four of rods here that's talking about marriage and, you know, celebration. But with all these cards here like this, this eight of cups, Aries, it look like y'all walked away or thinking about walking away. You know, flying the coop for the holidays. That ain't cool. That ain't cool. These are two breakup cards, by the way. This ain't me. I ain't said spirit said, okay? Mm -mm. Don't come from me. Okay? Aries, I know you will, <laughs> but don't do it. Spirit said. You may or have thought about walking away in your marriage or relationship. Okay? All right? Mm -hmm. Or you might be thinking about breaking the news about it. Or you got some news from someone telling you that they may be wanting to, you know, take a moment and, and step back and reevaluate how y'all relationship is going, you know? Again, this message is not for every Aries. This is a general message. I have no way of tapping into all the Aries here on the planet. These are the ones that I linked into. Okay. All right. In the future, it's talking about you probably feeling like you need to defend your territory. Defend your territory. This is the wounded warrior card nine of ones nine of rods um, whatever you going through may have have you feeling mentally feeling like you haven't been through the ringer
Spirit clarify the wounded warrior card with the two of wands. Aries, now you sat back and you you taking you taking your world back into your own hands after whatever transpired within maybe a marriage or a relationship, a separation or a divorce that's coming in in 2020 or maybe rolling over and y'all finally coming to finality of what you need to do. Um, it's your world, baby, Aries. Honey, your ships are coming in. For whatever you choose for your world. Not what somebody else is telling you or what you think somebody else may like. Don't last long. Mm. Mm, ask me, honey. Okay, you know, spirit is going to be here with you. You know, and if, always and forever. But mostly to making these decisions, these final decisions that you need to make. Probably on this. <coughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Marriage, um, relationship, business. Um, relationship, any kind of way that you can be intertwined with people. Spirit is saying that you need to make a choice, but you be from your higher self when you make this choice. Leave ego out of it, you know. What good for the goose may not be good for the gander. I hope I said that right. <laughs> um. not bad Aries we all go through things in life especially if you're over 25 and you're starting to really evaluate what you're going through so you don't keep going through the same cycles well, anyway enough of me hmm. let's see what my ancestors got to say for you about this the spirit of white life I'm going to be using a gypsy playing card deck A woman will soon invite you to go home. Go. Basically, my click said go home. Leave um, the ego out of it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Spirit, for taking me off. I'm crying like that. But they say, um, go home. Take ego out of it. Make a choice with going on in your home, in your situation, in your life, from your higher self, and they're going to be right there with you, rocking with you. Again, this message will not resonate with everyone, but if it do, please like, share, and subscribe. One day I'm going to get this camera position right and start looking all around the world and get with y'all right. Again, this is Love and Hope Tarot.